Welcome ladies and gentlemen to the Crypto Kings YouTube channel. So we're in part three now of our um, X99, MSI X99 um, mining rig. We have previously unboxed and we fitted the Be Quiet heatsink. Um, and now we're going to install the, um, the memory, uh, the RAM. So I've got DDR4. Uh, I always find it's good to look either on the MSI um, website for compatibility of CPUs and um, RAM or alternatively PC Part Picker is great, PCPartPicker.com um, is great just to find out um, for your type of motherboard stroke CPUs, um, what the compatible RAMs are, um, like there's so many options now, um, it's just really good to get that uh, validation before you spend your hard earned um, Dosh and um, buy these uh, items for your uh, mining rigs. So, it's, um, so what we're going to do is put you guys up there. Going to open the um, the RAM here. Let's get box. I'm just going to, you know, whilst you know, for pure gaming, you can install two, three, four, eight sticks of RAM for mining. Don't really need a lot of RAM, so I'm just going to be a cheapskate and um, just fit um, one eight gig worth of RAM um, in the it's always good to uh, go either you go online um, or you can look at your manual and you can see here that it says um, always insert memory modules into the dim one slot first and then it shows the combinations if you want to do two three four um, what combinations you might want to fill in but obviously we're just doing one so we make it nice and easy on ourselves and what, what I like to do is I normally just like to hover the RAM over because the the little groove there isn't exactly in the middle so you just want to make sure you know you're not putting it around the wrong way around and break, breaking anything so I always just like to sort of line it up like that first if that looks good we can just slide that in there Let's just make sure it's open so click unclick and we'll just push that down in there we go oh there's a little bit of wiggle in there I'm quite, I'm quite gentle with it, but to be honest, I think it needs a reasonable amount of firm pressure and click to get it down in there. So, probably just a little bit of light light in there. So, there you go, we got it in there now. Beautiful, we've got there. We've done the clip there, so it's clipped in nicely. And good, just to, good to do the wiggle test. It's really good. All right, that is the end of this short video, getting the uh, RAM in. Watch out for part four coming soon.